Assalamu alaikum guys once again I'm back with another quick tutorial and in this video I'll guide you how to like install Riot Vanguard if it's uh, not installing properly recently I just uninstall and then I try to reinstall the Riot Vanguard but um, like it's much buggy it's not easy to install it but don't worry there is a easy way first of all we will uh, just uninstall the whole game but make a backup of your game so here is the way guys just open the c drive and make a copy of your valorant game or any game that you are playing so just click on the c drive and then your game where you have uh, installed by default your game uh, path is here just copy the valorant folder right click on it and copy it copy your card just paste it in, in another drive okay now uh, you can also check out the services the vanguard if you have installed it then just right click on it and exit don't uninstall it just exit like uh, excite excite this vanguard so just right click on it and excite uh, exit vanguard whatever i am bad with english sorry for that and please don't try to uninstall through this method uh, just excite it and click on yes that's it and um, if you don't have the vanguard and still it's not uh, working like you can't install the vanguard then there is another way i'll guide you but for the moment um, for those guys who have the vanguard just excite it and click on yes okay now make sure the services uh, services are running or not if it's running then just disable the service um, for that just click on the windows icon then type services and hit enter and if you don't have vanguard then you still need to check out the services running or not sometimes it's uh, running like it's not deleted properly or uninstalled properly so your service still running so just click on the windows icon and then type services hit enter and you are here in the services mode okay now you just need to find the uh, vgc the vanguard uh, service just type v if it's appearing here then just right click on it in my case it's not running uh, so if it's running then just simply right click on it properties okay now just stop it first then startup type make it disable and hit apply okay and if it's not available here then that's great it's okay now the second step you need to do is just open the uh, file explorer this pc just type here this pc or any ways you just open the uh, this pc folder or c drive and then here you need to open the c drive in c drive program files and here you need to find the your vanguard folder so as you can see here is the your vanguard folder just right click on it and delete it okay that's it guys now finally we have a complete copy of my valorant game now what you need to do is just open the control panel and uninstall the um, your vanguard and also the um, valorant so just open the control panel type here hit enter okay now this time click on the uninstall a programs now here you need to find the vanguard your vanguard and right click on it uninstall yes that's it now simply uh, you need to uninstall the uh, valorant as well just simply right click on it and uninstall but before um, after copying the whole data then you uninstall the valorant so it's almost done 98 99 and it's 100 okay that's it now you can simply uninstall the valorant folder as well okay done now what you need is restart your pc once after restarting i'll show the further method uh, it's not finished yet so just restarting my pc okay once again we are back now this time uh, it's not important but uh, in my case i tried this method as well and uh, i think you need to try this i'm not pretty sure is it's important or not but you guys, uh, guys please do it for your um, like extra care 
what you need to do is make sure once again last time the root vanguard is available folder is available in program files or not if it's not then that's fine just close it and open the cc cleaner the link is given below if you don't have just try the free version and after trying this you can just uninstall it if you want and just like this uh, i'm gonna show you open the cc cleaner okay now we will clear or uh, registry uh, registry files of valorant and uh, rear vanguard simply you need to click on the registry on the left side and scan for issues now as you can see here i have a lot of missing registry files like the reward client services and some other uh, related to the reward games that's it guys now just click on the review selected issues and uh, as you can see here it's the vg, VG tray and uh, vgc.exe everything is here just review selected items and then click on no and fix all selected issues that's it now our problem has been solved simply you need to do is install your valorant once again um, i have already downloaded if you don't have then link is given below in the description just click on it and download it after downloading just program files now install valorant okay now the simple thing is just uh, click on the install and it says uh, 20.0 gigabytes so don't worry about it we have already a backup of our game we are not gonna download the complete 20 you can also change the path if you want otherwise it's okay that's not a big issue just click on install okay now it's around 205 or 14 um, mb files it will take around uh, four it depends on your internet guys if you have a faster internet then it will take only a few seconds and in my case it takes 17 minutes let's wait okay guys now it's done and uh, this method inshallah will work for you but uh, you need to upgrade your operating system before uh, when i was facing these issues that time i was using the windows uh, 2004 windows 10 version 2004 but uh, after updating my operating system a lot of uh, idiot like bugs are fixed you know you can see here installing your vanguard and uh, after your vanguard um, don't worry it's like jumping 1 5 10 then again goes down and up don't worry about it it's working super fine now on the back end now you can also copy your valorant uh, game back into the your games folder okay just open the uh, folder now I'm just uh, copying my file valorant file folder copying C and your games now just simply paste it here now both works uh, together it's okay it's not a big issue it will work fine so just wait for it okay 98% completed and uh, 99 100 finally it's finished now don't worry about it uh, it's not stuck on 95% actually it's scanning my files the game files what you need to do is simply log in your game so I'm using uh, the Facebook account I have uh, linked my Facebook account with my uh, Valorant game so simply I'm logging login with my Facebook account you can also log in and after login you will see it's uh, just finished but make sure after uh, login you need to restart your pc first and also it will scan your game files if it's corrupted then it will repair and uh, if there is any other update then definitely it will update first so as you can see guys now it's updating uh, my game first it will scan and then the missing file will be installed installed in valorant anyways now uh, the real vanguard problem has been solved as you can see here it's not appear yet but you can uh, launch the valorant just by clicking on the windows explorer and then uh, just uh, click on the program files and your vanguards and just turn your vanguard on 
I'll show you so just click on the Windows uh, Explorer C Drive program files and find the your Vanguard and here you can see everything is here VGC just double tap on the VGC and also VG tray uh, launch both these files and after launching these files you need to restart your PC and your problem has been solved 100% I hope you like this video hit the subscribe button and share it with friends and if you have any question just comment below I will try to solve it have a good day take care